Oh, are we are we on here? Are we working? Hello, hello, hello. Okay, good. You can hear me. All right, cool. Hey guys, it's Frank Lord here, and I am sitting here on the couch contemplating some things. Um, I try to go for a bike ride this uh, lovely afternoon. However, that was not happening because it is cold out today. And so I'm just sitting here relaxing now. Going to head to yoga soon. Um, and one of the things that I contemplated is, you know, I'm kind of, I'm kind of in a place now where it's like, well, I do these, you know, live astrology videos and it's hard because my schedule stays is so jam packed. Um, so sometimes they don't happen when promised. Um, I've been really committing to a lot of uh, email uh, stuff as far as, you know, like my daily emails, getting the email marketing done, blah, 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 blah. So now I have come to the uh, understanding that the best thing that I could do is potentially start doing a live, or excuse me, a video daily um, that will be posted on Facebook and or YouTube, uh, plus or minus um, a day, meaning Saturdays and Sundays may be hard. But I'm going to try to commit to doing that as well, too. So we'll just see how that goes. Um, and yeah, that's, that's really about it. So one of the things that I really have mm, kind of been paying more attention to is, um, you know, there's a lot of substantial transition in the uh, house system right now, okay, um, which is which is good. Um, <clears throat> and I feel like it's it's really affecting a lot of people in many uh, substantial ways, okay. Um, there's a lot of heaviness on the uh, horizon right now as far as um, as far as what people are anticipating um, there's a lot of transition that's happening um, for individuals a lot of good transition but also a lot of heaviness as well too so it's very it's very back and forth currently. We have Gemini in the house system. You know, Gemini is very um, Gemini can be very hard sometimes because it's one of those things where it's like, um, you know, it's one of those things where Gemini has very two very different sides. So it can be a little hard because sometimes what can happen is uh, Gemini, <clears throat> excuse me, can cause us this quality of being like, yeah, I want this, but in essence, I really want this and I don't know how to substantially go about doing it. So I think one of the, the big qualities for people right now, um, for individuals right now, is really sticking to the uh, substantial 
uh, truth. What is your truth? What is your purpose? And recognizing that most importantly, even when, you know, things are a little hectic or haywire or feel, you know, not up to par. Okay. You know, am I sticking to my truth? Am I following my true purpose? Am I doing, you know, my life's duty, my work's duty, even if I feel distracted and or not um, truly grounded at this time? So remembering to, you know, stick your, your goals and your commitments forward um staying true to your goals and your commitments and really you know substantially allowing yourself to understand you know the the outcome okay what is my goal here what are my true commitments and what is my truth and my integrity to myself even when you feel the mm, drive or want to kind of like pull backwards in a way or you know go back to what's comfortable for you it's very important to stick out your goals and your commitments in this life especially at a time like now we have Taurus in the house system too so when the Taurus moon which is really strong in the regards of push and pull right now when the Taurus moon is present and or presented which it is currently you know it's so important for us to stick to our goals and our determination because Taurus is, is the the planet the sign of strength is the sign of you know strong willed energy okay and when you've got Gemini in the house system as well um, some things that can happen are um, some contradictory uh, feelings of this push and pull, you know, this inadequate sense of not feeling driven or distracted or whatever it may be, you know, sticking to your commitments now. That's so very important for you, even when there's a lot of heaviness. Uh, this transition that we're experiencing in the regards to astrological uh, outlook is, you know, is going to be coming to an end potentially by Friday. But as the full moon, which is coming, the full moon energy comes in. So if you look out at the sky, the moon's present, the moon is visible, and we're going into the full moon when that is presenting itself day by day you know as it's as it's coming to the full moon cycle it's a really great time to you know initiate any goals or determination or qualities of clear true being and or essence who am i and what is my truth Okay, this moon is rather powerful. Um, I haven't done the research on it yet, and I don't know why it has a sense of powerful drive, but it's very powerful and it's causing a lot of emotional up and down. It's causing a lot of emotional, you know, back and forth um, qualities of emotion. And so it can feel extremely heavy that's a double negative no it's not it can feel very powerful as well too depending on your sign depending on how uh your sign lies within the zodiac and or the house system so in in a time of need or if you feel you know like you're not substantially grounded right now which that is a very common trait for a lot of people you know you've got this tremendous energy that is really really pulling and pushing 
when this energy is, you know, in the Taurus house system, Taurus, Taurus moon, which is, this is a Taurus moon, along with the Gemini in there, it can kind of be a little contradictory and or opposing in a sense. It can feel like mentally your mind is speaking and these phenomenal, beautiful, great ideas are presenting themselves. But at the same time, you don't feel this adequate sense of balance or groundedness in your life. And that's really for you to substantially figure out. And uh, you will. So make sure that you are sticking to your commitments, to your sense of groundedness, and understand that the outcome is going to really show itself clearly. Okay, It's a time of work right now, and it's a time of dedication and much needed work at this time for yourselves and for a lot of people around you as well, too, when they see you strive in this life, you're going to really um, give them a sense of determination and direction. So be the guide for people or for individuals in your life who truly need it the most. Okay. And just remember that. That's what I have for you guys today, and I will talk to you tomorrow. Have a good one.